Hey, what's up, guys? This is your Antisocial, and I'm going to be doing a reading on Sky Jackson. This video is for entertainment purposes. Now, Sky Jackson was arrested for domestic domestic violence, um, putting her hands on her boyfriend, and allegedly she's pregnant and engaged. So we're gonna see, um, like, what's the energy surrounding her, and you know, if she's really pregnant and fucking engaged. I don't know her boyfriend's name, so I'm just gonna call him her boyfriend. So spirit. Uh, what's going on with Sky Jackson? Like, what's her energy? Is Sky Jackson okay? Is Sky Jackson okay? Is Sky Jackson okay, Spirit? Now we have the Eight of Pentacles in the back of the deck. We have the Higher Font. We have the Ten of Pentacles. We have the Nine of Pentacles. Um, we also have the Temperance card. We have the Five of Swords. We have the Six of Swords. Now, Sky Jax's energy. I honestly think that... Um, It's telling me what happened, okay? That's basically what I'm getting. It's telling me what happened, okay? Instead of, like, telling me what's her energy now. So, the Eight of Pentacles, I definitely do think that Sky Jackson could have been, like, um, she could have came from working, right? So, she could have been working on something at the time um, or, like, working on something before the incident happened, whether she was working out or, like, um, just doing something. But before the whole situation happened before she was with her boyfriend she was definitely doing something eight of pentacles um with the hierophant and the ten of pentacles yeah it's giving like committed to work committed to making money committed to you know herself nine of pentacles definitely does talks about like somebody acting single um somebody acting single somebody doing what they want to do putting themselves first we also got the temp temperance card, which talks about this person being sensible. So I honestly think that her boyfriend was acting single. His energy is in here. Nine of Pentacles, temperance card. I do think that he was acting single, probably of sorts, and it kind of pissed her off. And they definitely got into a little argument. Power of swords, argument, fights, someone feeling defeated. Six of swords, walking away. Um, it's either he felt defeated or she felt defeated, but it's definitely giving like fights, arguments type vibes. Seven of Swords, cheating, uh, uh, Knight of Pentacles, and the Four of Cups. So it's definitely giving that she tried to be strategic with this. So I'm not really sure if she is pregnant or married. Maybe, I mean, pregnant or engaged. Maybe she lied with the Seven of Swords to kind of like get away with stuff, but it didn't work. Um... The Nine of Pentacles and the Four of Cups, I definitely do think that, um, it's definitely given, like, somebody was acting single, and that's the whole reason why this shit happened in the first fucking place. Um, Four of Cups definitely talks about disconnection, empathy, so her boyfriend, if he's still her boyfriend, he does feel bad for her. We also got the Magician card. The king of I was right. I was right. Her boyfriend was acting single. He comes up as the king of pentacles. Um Yeah, he doesn't really care about her. Not if pentacles really gives it away. You know, this is somebody acting single. Now usually in a reading I wouldn't take this as somebody acting single. But the energy of the reading with the four of cups and the seven of swords and it's just giving he doesn't really give a fuck about her like that you know like this is just a good time not not a long time type vibes you know um but she's not innocent either seven of swords she could have been they could have been cheating on each other but it really just looks about her being strategic you know to not get arrested and she got arrested anyway um she definitely fought him though she definitely put her hands on him five of swords you know and Six of Swords walked away, being strategic, you know, not getting what she wanted, though. The Chariot card, the Magician card. Um, it's definitely giving... But the Magician card is definitely giving that... Um, uh, chariot card. I wonder if he called the cops. 
I wonder if he called the cops. I wonder if he called the cops. I wonder, I wonder. This is kind of giving like set up vibes, magician cards, king of pentacles. I wonder what happened here. Did he call the cops? Cherry card, move away from the situation. Somebody, somebody, somebody definitely planned to call the cops. Magician. Okay. Um, the star card healing. The Knight of Swords. She is very aggressive. Sky Jackson has issues. She's very aggressive. Knight of Swords, Star Card. Like this is the this boy trying to heal. And this is her just being very aggressive. Like nasty energy. Disgusting. The world card. The ace of swords conflict. More conflict. More arguing. More fights. Seven of Pentacles, him being patient with her. Four of Swords retreat. Yeah, take time for yourself, boo, because you look crazy. And this energy is crazy, too. Like, what the fuck is going on? Like, why are you so aggressive, Sky? Why is she so aggressive? Ugh. Like, for no reason. Mm-mm. But uh, she's not doing well, y'all. She's not doing well. She could have mental issues. She's definitely not doing well. It's definitely giving mental breakdown. It's really giving mental fucking breakdown and it's giving a mental breakdown she's not doing well definitely not um let's see if she's really pregnant spirit is guy jackson really pregnant We have the Seven of Pentacles in the back of the deck, uh, and the High Priestess, the Sun card, the Six of Cups. Oh. Before I react, let me just keep on pulling out cards. Queen of Wands, Five of Cups, Lord, Six of Wands. Now, the High Priestess does talk about knowledge, high morals. So she does have high morals for herself. You know, she does want kids, but it's giving more so like the future vibes. Like I want kids in the future. Um, the Six of Cups definitely does talks about like love messages. The Queen of Wands, the Five of Cups definitely does talks about like uh, regret, depression. Um, so she is pregnant. She's not really happy about it now. Or there's someone that is not happy about it. We got the Six of Wands, which talks about her keeping her head up high. The Hierophant. The Justice card. The Eight of Swords. Somebody feeling trapped. Trap vibes. Um, this kind of like being the truth. Commitment here. If she's pregnant, she's going to be committed to the pregnancy. Um, even though she does have high morals for herself. Um... It's really giving she got herself caught the fuck up, not gonna lie. Dev card, five of wands, the ace of cups. They could have been arguing about this ace of cups, arguing about a baby, arguing about marriage. Bitch, you about to be a single mother. <laughs> I'm sorry, y'all. Ace of pentacles. Yeah, she could be pregnant. If she's pregnant, bitch, you're about to be a single mother. You're about to be a single mother. The apple ain't fall, fall from the goddamn motherfucking tree, bitch. Um, but she could have also lied. Because I got the seven of swords before. Um, in the last shuffle. So she could have lied. So she couldn't, you know, have gotten arrested. Uh, Spirit is... I don't think they're engaged at all. So I'm not even going to answer that. Um, what's the future for Scott Jackson? What is the future for Scott Jackson Spirit? Eight of Wands in the back of the deck. She could travel. 
Um, she could travel. She could uh, travel, take time for herself. Nine of Cups, her being very content. Um, Six of Pentacles, her being spoiled. Page of Cups, the Hangman, the Seven of Wands. I feel like the guy that she's with, he could try to romance her. Page of Cups, Six of Pentacles, the Hangman, um, the Seven of Wands. Her being naive, trying to force something. Page of Swords, Negotiations, Gossip, Five of Pentacles, um, the Empress card. She could definitely be pregnant. Sky Jackson could be pregnant. That might not be a lie. Empress card, Five of Pentacles. She's definitely going to be worried about herself. Um, worried about money, worried about her career. High Priestess. Eight of Cups, Disappointment. Yeah, bitch, you're going to be a single mom. Nine of Cups. It's mm, Eight of Cups, Nine of Cups. He could change. The person that she's with could change. Four of Pentacles, her keeping to herself. The Fool card. Making reckless decisions. The, the Wheel of Fortune. This is her karma. This is definitely her karma. Ten of Wands, seeing him as a burden. The Emperor card, the Three of Swords. Her and this boy are going to break up, but they're going to be sensible with it. They could break up and they could reconciliate. The Sun card, there could definitely be a fucking kid. So, Five of Cups, Regret, the Five of Swords. This is very toxic. The Strength card, Nine of Wands. She's not going to trust him, the Magician card, the Star card. Hopefully, she ain't pregnant, but if she is, she's going to be a single mom. For sure, 100% like a single mom. Single mom vibes. But there you guys have it. Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe. And peace. Like, it doesn't matter if they get married or not. Like, she's going to end up a single mom. Because she, she's a ticking time bomb.